So you're thinking of moving to Covington, Louisiana, will you come to the right place? If you're wondering what you can get for $300,000, we're going to cover three different houses within the $300,000 range today so you can know what to expect. At the moment, we're at the Pinnacle Parkway Shopping Center, which is a great shopping center located in Covington. Real quick, don't forget, if you're moving in nine days or 90 days, give me a call, shoot me a text, or send me an email, because my team would love to help you with your smooth move to Covington, Louisiana. Don't forget to like and subscribe as well. Now, back to it. We're in Pinnacle Shopping Center, and right behind me is one of my most favorite places to go, the Escapeology. It is so much fun, not only for like a birthday party or just a girl's night out, or maybe even a guy's night out, um, but it's also cool. It's one of the team building things we've done or we like to do with the team um, because it's fun. You get locked in this room and you gotta escape and work together and it's, it's really, really cool. So I definitely highly suggest it. Some of the other things in the shopping center are things like Kirkland's, Kohl's, all kind of fun places where you can spend your money. And speaking of spending your money, let's go see what 300,000 will get you. Let's head that way right now. This house is located on Crestville Hills Loop. It, it does also have association, association fees or home association fees and those are running $27 a month. This house is listed at $299.9. Now I put it at $300,000. I know it's right below, but I mean, it's pretty much the price of $300,000. That's why I put it in this video. $299,900. Four bedrooms, two bathrooms, built in 2020. So it's nice and new, practically. 2341 square feet. That's 128 per square foot. The property details include a huge private master bedroom and bathroom with double vanity tub, separate stand-up shower, and an enormous walk-in closet. I am all about the big walk-in closets. It's an open floor plan with a breakfast and dining off the kitchen. It includes stainless steel appliances, custom lighting and blinds, a tankless hot water heater, a two-car garage. This one also has a fenced-in backyard with oak tree, which backs up to green space. That is nice. It's also located in a non-flood zone. So that's another huge bonus as well. As you can see, the ones in the $300,000 price range seem to have nice side yards and they seem to be fenced. So I think those are definitely pluses. now stopping by to Amy Court. This house is listed for $325,000. It was built in 2007, 2907 square feet, which is only $112 a square foot. That is super inexpensive for a lot of what we've been seeing. It was built in 2007 with four bedrooms, two and a half bathrooms. It's on a 0.26 acre lot. There are association fees and those run you $21 a month. This property is located in Tallow Creek subdivision. It's four bedrooms plus an office, dining room, sunroom, and a bonus room. And I'm gonna say that again because that's a lot, a lot of bang for your buck, especially at that price per square foot. Four bedrooms plus an office, dining room, sunroom, and a bonus room. So that bonus room could easily be a fifth bedroom. There's beautiful new wood floors installed on most of the first floor. There's tons of storage and counter space in the kitchen. There's an extended covered patio. It's located on a quiet dead end street. I've always loved dead ends and it's kind of funny, but every single house I have lived on since I have moved out of my parents' home has been on a dead end street. Um, there's an oversized fenced in lot that backs to an undeveloped land, which I think is a really nice plus. And there's a two car garage. This home is in a flood zone X, which means typically that the flood insurance would not be required, but I suggest every single person in Louisiana should purchase flood insurance for protection. This 
house is on Beau Aubrey Street, which is located in the Beau Aubrey subdivision. Hopefully I'm saying that right. This house is listed for $329,000. It's four bedrooms, two bathrooms. It was built in 2006. It's 2,001 total square feet on a 0.29 acre lot. That price comes per square foot to $164. This house does have home association fees, which are $26 a month. Some of the details of this house, the kitchen includes granite countertops, stainless steel appliances, a cool pantry, and a butler's pantry. A spacious living room with a gas, starter, wood-burning fireplace, which is so cool. I really, really, really miss my gas starter fireplace. We haven't really used ours at all because wood is just so messy. I know that's crazy, but man, I sure wish, um, I sure miss pressing that starter button. Sorry for that distraction there. The additional bathroom includes natural lighting, plenty of storage, and lots of counter space. There's two different areas that could be used as a dining room, which means you could have two dining rooms or maybe you could have a dining room and then an office. Although there is an office space with a built-in desk and additional storage, which is great for someone who works from home, or maybe the kids could use that for homework and you could use one of the other two rooms as your own office. The master bedroom includes double vanities, a beautiful soaking tub, and a separate stand-up shower. This house has a two-car garage that's attached, as well as additional spaces for boat and RV access parking, which is super nice. There's actually additional parking in front and behind the gate, which is awesome. Can't not mention that it has a huge fenced-in backyard, another big plus, a custom pavilion covered patio space, and a large outdoor shed with the door and windows for additional storage. Whether you're moving in nine days or 90 days, give me a call, shoot me a text, or send me an email because my team would love to help you with your smooth move to Covington, Louisiana. Thank you so much for exploring the 300,000 price range in Covington, Louisiana today. I look forward to seeing you around town.